Oh. <laughs> oh, and also one of Amanda's friends died today. Which, what? Yeah. Oh, I, I said that on stream. <laughs> I feel really bad. I do feel really bad about that, but I shouldn't have said that on stream. Like very close friends, or? I believe so. Or that she sucks. said she said old friend, but still, I mean, any friend dying is sad. It's shocking, absolutely. Yeah. All right, where were we in this? Oh, I got. I think I got all the keys. Did we? Yeah, you fell asleep, but I did. Okay. Man, what is it with this game? It's giving you motion sick, sick, sick. It's just, it's like weird. I, I can't, I literally can't explain it. It's like not at a natural frame rate. <laughs> Didn't you fix it the other night and made it a little bit better? Or is this. The fixed version. This is the fixed version. Okay. It's okay. I can play with it for a, a little while. <sighs> Are you at the final boss? Last call. Have been yapping about some big mysterious dude running around cracking skulls and is that Vincent D'Onofrio? This is it. You're the monkey wrench. I don't know who that is. is. Bender, so uh, Jake the dog. Right. Wait a second. I seen that stick before. Maybe when my father knocked your block off with it. Your father? Wow. You're a Cooper. You know that Zingus Rakamagookus had a lot of nice pictures, but way too many big boys. So you don't mind just handing it over? Why? <laughs> what are you kidding? You break into my place, steal my It does sound like him, huh? Trash the joint, yeah. I feel transgressed and violated. Let's rock. Pre Futurama. Yeah. Look at this guy go. Whoa, what? Oh god. One shot's too strong for your cane. You're gonna have to find some other way to stop it. Why don't you try hitting some of those mirrors? That may redirect the sunlight to your advantage. Mirrors? Oh, I died. Mm. The hell? This is not what I would have expected. Oh shit. Damn, you can't get hit at all. Man, it's tough. Yeah. Okay, you're getting to a group of it. Might get a game over, but that's okay. There's like no penalty for game over. No, there isn't. I mean, besides getting set back on like really long levels, but that's really good. Oh Damn! Oh my god. <gasps> the, the other thing about this game is all the enemies have like pinpoint accuracy. Yeah, you just have to stay far away from the dude. Hit me when I'm like this. What? What's what's the objective here? Turn on all the all the mirrors. Get all the mirrors. I don't think you can hit me like this. Miss that one. Next level. Uh-huh. Oh my gosh. 
No, oh my goodness! I'm thinking he can't hit me when I'm like this. No, I don't think he can. Nice. Heck. Yeah, <laughs> bitch. He can't hit you when you're in roll mode! This is what we gamers do. Figure out all the exploits. What am I missing? So weird he can't hit you when you're like that. Oh boy. Oh, I can't roll this time. Oh! Oh, you have to do the circle. Yeah. <gasps> what? I oh, no! Oh my god. That is so punishing. They don't make games this hard anymore. It's okay, we know the trick already. Upstairs. Out the way, bitch. Hogwarts Legacy Terror coming out. I know, what day is it coming out again? Oh, God. Um... Gosh, I don't know. I don't know the exact day anymore. Yeah. I should I should pre-order it. I feel like there's no point not pre-ordering it at this point. Like, if you know you're gonna get it. I have to pay $70 for Chris's. What? Holy crap! Let go. You can. Okay, if you jump. Damn it. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> oh my god! This is this is just a tough one, an annoyance factor. It's okay, you know what to do. Speed runs. The most speedy gamer in the world. You can get all the this one. I give you. Fast. I give you allowance to speed run this one. <laughs> Only I can skip this part. Thing I, got a spare upstairs. I love this guy's design. Alright, alright, here goes. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm waiting for Terra. Good. I feel like I gotta wait this one. Oh, yeah. No, go. You got this, you got this. You want all of that stupid picture book? Dogs don't like light? I don't know. I burnt him like an ant. You don't wanna be you. Mugshot section of the Thievius Raccoonus contain an entry from my gunslinging ancestor, Tennessee Kid Cooper. His specialty was the rail walk and rail slide. Moves perfected through a lifetime of theft in the old west. Cool fact, a lot of the stuff made it to getting infamous. Getting out of town proved to be a little more challenging than getting in. What do you mean? Like all these moves made it to infamous. Inspector Fox went for the next oh, best thing. Yeah, so like the slide was the thing they pulled in, the, the walk was the thing he did. That was the end of Mugshot's gambling empire. And Mesa City it's a shame Infamous never home. made it any more than the PS3. Well, we and PS3 is like notoriously the hardest and thing to emulate. Ready for our next mission. I figured out a way to get us to Haiti. This is one of the last days I'm gonna be sleeping in this bed. Terror girl. I figured out a way to get us to Haiti. I'm going to Haiti, Tara. Haiti? Mm -hmm. That's so weird. It's called Haiti, but I love you, that place. <laughs> Should be called Luffy. Born into a family of mystics, <laughs> other children found her scary. Teaching herself to summon the undead provided what few friends she had. A career in crime allowed an adult Ms. Ruby to punish the world for fearing her as a child. Chief mystic for the Fiendish Five, her powers allowed them to break both the laws of man and nature at the same time. Gator? Despite the whirlwind success that, of her that's youth, right. she managed to slip into obscurity. Ooh. Last known sightings claim she headed out of civilization and deep into the Haitian jungle. Sly Cooper in. Vicious voodoo. Ooh, me like. <laughs> Terra is kind of a voodoo queen. She has a lot of, I don't do voodoo. She has a lot of um, straw dolls with my face on it with like knives and shit and acid poured on them. Yeah, like last night, Andrew's stomach was upset and little did he know, I like shoved a bunch of needles in his stomach area and on my voodoo doll. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> you ain't the swamp now. Swamp's a pain. Get away from me! Sorry, Sly, but this is one mission you will have to accomplish without me. You don't believe in ghosts, do you? Sure I do. <laughs> Where are all your friends? Tara, I had a dream last That's night no with you and it. Mm. We, we, we were going to a like. Suck it up. Here, I'll let them finish. We got work to do. All right then. Don't How polite of you. you. You mean the raccoon rail walk? The roots and vines around here are perfect for that. All you gotta do is jump and hit the circle button. Especially where you see the bark has been worn away. And we're in super slick from Mickey Slime and Moss. You'll rail slide like a skater riding pipe. I'm liking it. Um, so I had a dream that we went to a western ghost town. And, um... I was filming, we were filming stuff for my job there, and um, we were having a really great time, and we were seeing like actual ghosts, it was fucking crazy. Whoa, that's cool. Um, 
but like a bunch of influencers came and like they heard it was like super haunted and they were like ruining our experience and you're getting super mad. <laughs> and you were like, you're like, Andrew, you have to fucking say something to them. I'm like, ugh, all right. And they were like getting super like, what, what, bro, what? <laughs> Like, get these influencers, influencers out of here. Get these fucking influencers. Stop them from being our ghost fucking adventures. They're just- we're disturbing the spirits. But they're- they're disturbing the spirits. They were disturbing the spirits. I think you we said that in, in my dream. Oh my god. We got in trouble with Spanish Point, um, when we were in high school. Me, Chris, and Joe. And their friend Adrian. And we went, we did the ghost walking tour on uh, Halloween. <laughs> and um, we were fucking around and making jokes. And one of the people on the tour were like, um, they, some of the, I feel like the, some of the spirits here think that there are some people that are being disrespectful. <laughs> um, <laughs> and we, and they were clearly talking about us because we we're just, you know. Walking around near the some some in the burial mounds, like you could see the mounds, right? And uh, yeah, we were like, well, we disagree, but okay. Oh, that's right, I can't drown anymore. <laughs> we disagree. <laughs> um, I disagree with your assertion. Oh, oh. What this one's I... definitely a little bit more challenging than the others, do you think? A, a little bit. <laughs> How do we get over there? You don't even take damage anymore. Yeah, from the water, it's nice. That would be fucking annoying, huh? Damn. I guess I'm not supposed to get over here yet. <laughs> we disagree. The spirits like our presence. I, th I think that the ghosts would find our jokes, um... Fun. If you if you heard a ghost giggling when, when you guys were doing that, would that encourage you or make you want to stop? Oh, it would encourage us, no doubt. Ghost stand up, where the audience is full of just <laughs> spirits. Ooh, this is gonna be tough because. The bottles are the same color as the environment in this one. We got this. <gasps> Am I just jumping down from here? Alright. Okay. What the hell am I supposed to do about this guy? Oh, I see. He's a shaman, Terra. <laughs> I like this music. Is this in Haiti or Louisiana? Haiti, but it's got that like Louisiana influence. Miss Ruby's lair. To get in, no problem. Don't get cocky or you'll end up with your head shrunk to the size of a pea. You've gotta get past those photo cards, and I'm warning you, they're made and they work like a team. So do we, buddy. Well, they were 
aren't so bad. Ooh. Smart there, Bentley. Because uh, he, he got fooled by me literally just turning a corner. Oh, that's right, the coins just come to me now. You still kind of have to gather them, but. Yeah. So muddy. I love this game, but yeah, this is hurting my eyes. Let me play the next one, it should be better. It is the weirdest sensation motion sickness, for me at least. It's literally just like being overheated. <laughs> Isn't that weird? Yeah, I don't know. I don't get it. So uh, the same sensation. Like when I get motion sickness on a car ride, I have to open the window, no matter what the temperature is. Yeah. So how many are we missing? Two. Oh, there's one. Oh my gosh. Of course. One left. The one left challenge. You think it's on this <laughs> island somewhere? Look around. Spell. Oh, was it the candles? You've done it! The Lojo Force Field is down, and you can steal the key! That was a classic Let's Player moment. Bentley totally told me that, and I didn't listen. <laughs> Wait, that's not Bentley, is it? Bentley's the hippo. No, Murray's the Murray's hippo. Murray's the hippo. Thank you, sorry. Tara, you're so right. You're so right. I would never forget Murray. Oh, there it is. The bottle! <laughs> you're looking straight at it. There we go. <laughs> you're like, where could it be? Where is it? <laughs> Um, he's right behind me, isn't he? <laughs> it's right behind me, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. That just happened. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeehaw! Press the circle to enter the vault code. If I did my math right, and I always do my math right, then the combination has got to be 588. Ooh, what's this one gonna be, Tara? Electrified! Kelly McCooper's notes on how to harness the electromagnetic field created by a rolling raccoon. Now your raccoon roll move will really pack a punch. Oh, nice. Plus, it should give you a nice tingling sensation. What is that last part supposed to mean? That gives you a boner. Oh, look at me. Oh, okay. So you have like an electric force field. 
Yeah. Sucker Punch, if you're out there, please make another Sly Cooper. Please. <laughs> or or Infamous. I'll take that as well. I love both games. They made, um... Was it Shadow Tsushima? Ghost of Tsushima? Yeah. That might not be them, but they made a Samurai game not too long ago. For mm. PS5. It's like one of PlayStation 5's only exclusive games. Um... Bobby Boucher, Black Cooper is the devil! <laughs> but yeah, they made that samurai game. Um, apparently it was really good. Uh, I wouldn't know, I don't have PS5. But, um... It is weird, like, PS5 being one of the only PlayStation consoles that I've never played. I mean, I'm using the controller, so in some way, I'm... In some way, I've kind of... Getting part of the experience. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's just, um... It's expensive for not a lot of reason to be expensive. Like, there's seriously... Yeah. Honest to God, and this is real, there are only nine exclusive PlayStation 5 games. Nine. I would wait. To get like the console, Whoa. and there's more stuff out. Yeah, I just don't see a reason to anymore. Yeah, so I have to give Chris my Visa card now because I owe him a freaking Hogwarts legacy. Oh, because he, he got, got the job. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's very that's nice good. of you. Nice yeah, I'm that. just like, fucking thank god, like, at least have some fucking drive, better stick drive, you know, establish yourself somewhere, Should spend some, some time, Yeah. and, uh, eat shit, basically, eat shit, to get done with it. <laughs> That's what I had to do. It's true. Don't don't take the easy route. Not nah, saying. Uh, I. There was almost never a time, besides being in college, obviously, that I didn't like. I just straight up did not have a job. Like I was always doing something for money at some point, or I was in school. Yeah. So. Like, kind of, like, it, it just can't, it can't be healthy to, to not, like, have your mind be active in some way. Yeah, like, I understand if you need a break from time to time, but the break shouldn't be longer than, like, two months tops. Like, like, you know, kids in school, they get two months off of school, right? That's right. sufficient amount of time to, like, you know, that's a break, right? Two months is a break. Six months? That ain't a break. You're just not doing anything. Yeah. Oh, come on. <laughs> yeah, no, you're right. <laughs> okay, so you can go back around now.
I mean, I just, I have the people in my life that would ensure that I would never be, like, never be on a break, ever. They just Breaks are allow. good. It's not, they're not bad. Breaks are good. Oh, I'm not saying they're to... bad. I'm just saying that that's, that's just the way I look. That's not the case for you, yeah. yeah. I think men that mentally they are good for everybody, you know? If you're go, go, go all, all the time, you're gonna reach a point where you're gonna feel burnt out. Um, I mean, the break for, no. for me, the break was being in college, I guess, right? It was something a little bit different. Like, what was I doing when I was in Farmingdale? I guess I was doing... I should be looking to see if I'm missing any bottles. Yeah, move, fucker. Oh. That's okay. Yeah. Boing. Whoa. Jeez. Um. <coughs> I was doing crossbow when I was in farming jail stuff. I mean, that wasn't really a, a steady job by any means, but it was, um. It was money, like I had income. In some way or form. But I, I will say that I was, like, that was probably when I was at my laziest. Even, like, but that's, that was the pandemic, right? The, the, I feel like that's a, that's a little bit different. That's probably the biggest quote-unquote break I think I've had in my life. <laughs> mm -hmm. And it was depressing. You weren't even on a break. Yeah, it wasn't really a break. It was a break with me. You have free reign to do anything that you want, whenever you want. True. Yeah. That was when I made those paths in the woods. I love that. That that was a very peaceful time. <laughs> that that was peaceful for me because it was like, whoa. I was listening to podcast. I was getting outside, trying to, uh... Jesus. Just trying to stay active. And I think I was succeeding, honestly. But, I mean... It, it, I'd, I'd be fucking silly to say it wasn't fucking depressing not being able to see anybody. That sucked. Especially when I was, like, getting along with the people in my classes, you know. Mm-hmm. Whoa. When did you- I forget, when did you finish school, Terra Girl? I honestly couldn't tell you. Um, 20... Maybe like 2019? 2019? For my associates? Yeah. Something like that. Am, am wait a second, no. No, that, that can't be true. No, wait. Because I was 20 when I worked at Burns Court and then I went back to school. Oh, man. So, 2015. Yeah, I would say like 2017 or 2018. Damn it, I just sent myself back. And you weren't working at the time, right? No, that last year when I was finishing school, I didn't. I didn't work because I wanted to ensure that I got A's in all my classes. But, I could have been doing more, I just wasn't capable of doing that, because I have a habit that you, that you know of that uh, inhibited me from being able to Oh gosh. Do. Holy shit. Oh, the bottle. That's not fair. What the fludge? Get the... Oh, I... I just should have died this time. 
Okay. I thought that was supposed to save me. Mm. This camera angle is not doing me any favors. Am I gonna die? Oh. Oh my freaking god. This camera angle is really friggin' with me. Okay, so weird thing. Right now, the game looks perfectly fine. Whoa. <laughs> what the fuck just happened there? I don't know. But yeah, like right now the game looks totally fine. Like it's not it's not making me dizzy right now. Maybe it's just certain parts. Could be, could be. Man, they're really trying to mess with my head with these camera angles. Come on. You need one more bottle. Where is it? Do you know? No, I don't. Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh my god. This is actually a fucking rush. Oh. Jeez Louise. That's kind of scary. Please don't send me back. It's fine. Don't worry. You got all you needed. You just gotta go back to the vault. I no, I gotta go through the whole level again to get to the vault. No, it's fine, Andrew. It's fine. Uh. Don't be so exasperated. You got every all the bottles. Celebrate. No, no, no. Oh, stop being such a Debbie Downer. <laughs> I'm gonna deal with this beast again. The spooky beast. Where is the actual... Where is the, the thing? Oh. <laughs> That's not what I meant to do. I'm gonna be down there. Is that probably it over there, right? Speedrunning this whole damn game. Oh. He speedrunned the whole damn game. Falling into the swamp many times, but surviving. It's a good thing that I can swim now, kind of. Oh! Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, you stupid. Those mosquitoes are hard to fight. I need that extra blendy. Chili? Yeah. Thank you. 
Oh, come on. Showed me a cool album the other night. I think it was a good album. Very interesting album. Very varied album. I don't know what the album was. In. Called Void. Or no, the band is called Void, right? Yeah. What's the, what's the album's name again? Um, it's called It's called Virtue. Demons he had to overcome. Uh, actually, Did he say something about demons? He said he overcome some personal demons to get this ah, way. A more modern <laughs> oh. Coop's computer hacking technique. Using the data on this page, I should be able to tap the duty roster at each hideout and project guard information into your binocucom. Nice. So you have to get seven more keys? Is that what's going on here? They're just three right now and then seven later. Three now, seven later, I think. Whoa. You're fine. Terry thinks I'm like gonna have a meltdown any minute. <laughs> I'm done, I've had it, I hate this game. Just a little sloppy is all. That's okay. That's what they they tell me. Who okay. tells you that? They all just call me Sloppy Andy. There goes Sloppy Andy. <laughs> sloppy Andy. Whoa, what the? Looks like a ghost or some shit. Clarence Dupree, bloody as suck, yes, enjoy Sunday picnics. Marcel Woodfist, Shambles Mountain, devoted ecologist. What the hell does this, what, what good does this do for me? This is like Watch Dogs, you know, you like, in Watch Dogs, you hack everyone's phone to see what they are. There's the safe up there. This place is really haunted, Tara. Dude, look at these gluey globs of wax. What? Tara gave me a look for saying that. You give me a look, and then I give you a look. <laughs> It 
Must be some kind That's of bad luck. Generator. Maybe if you smash them all, you'd be safe. Ooh. A safe. We should be looking out for safes. Excuse me, Mr. Mosquito. Watch out, please do not suck me. Please do not suck me off. Sorry. What? Marcel Woodfish, devoted ecologist. Oh. Wasn't that supposed to hurt him? Well, it was. <laughs> it didn't work. Oh, they put me back here. I'm in the swamp. Killing ghosts? I didn't know you could kill a ghost. Are they real ghosts? Or just projections? I think they're real. This is some. Oh! oh. I mean, I probably should have seen that coming. Bustin', bustin' makes me feel good. Just saying. Tear does bustin' make you feel good? <laughs> she don't know I how guess. to answer that, folks. You know what I love about the Sly games? All the sound effects are very satisfying. Mm -hmm. It's a very meaty game. Like, everything you hit, like, makes your control rumble. always do with more lives so there's been this crazy thing Tara recently like so I, I've been talking a lot about this but we are really on like the precipice of like huge technological software growth because of AI mm -hmm. um, and just recently some Polish development studio developed a voice AI that can like perfectly mimic people's voices and cadence yeah mm -mm. It, it is insane so people have been putting celebrity voices to it through them and making them say like really horrendous shit <laughs> This is gonna be a huge change. I, I 
I really think this is where it's gonna start getting a little nuts. Because it's yeah. it's scary how good it is. Yeah, I mean obviously people are governments and things and CIA and all this yeah. stuff are gonna be using that or being on the lookout for that, detecting what's real, what's not. It's the age of what's real and what's not real. Yeah. This one is like nuts though, because like right, okay, right, you can you can make images talk right but they look kind of silly and stupid that was a tricky one right there i'm glad i saw that um mm -hmm. right you can make ai do paintings and stuff like that you can make ai look make really realistic looking photographs there's been one that's been like kind of making its rounds of like these girls in bikinis or whatever and, and like people are arguing whether or not the picture is ai and it is and that's how good it is um, and, what the hell? And, uh, this one's really gonna stir some shit, though. Like, I, because, oh my fucking god, these mosquitoes are so annoying. It's also really nasty. <laughs> you suck your blood and then fucking sneeze it the hell out. Okay, it, worked. it kind of worked that time. I'm not going to use but that. But it hurts you yeah. in the process, too. Uh oh, I'm done with three lives. Just be careful. Because, like, this one is so good, it's making, like, voice actors, like, pointless. That That's how good this one is. Like, people put the Stanley Parable, um... Uh, narrator into it and it's like dead on it's dead on cadence and everything like that is insane to me um people put reggie's voice into it and they made him talk about how he wants to fuck Isabel from Animal Crossing. Hold on, I'm gonna I'm gonna play it for you, Tara. Oh fuck off. Fucking things. Before you fall asleep, I gotta play this for you. Okay. You're you're gonna fucking laugh. Holy fucking shit. I want- This is so... I'm gonna see if I can, uh... Can I pause? Okay. Listen, there. Holy fucking shit. I want to bang the Animal Crossing dog so goddamn bad. I can't stand it anymore. Every time I go to Town Hall, I get a massive erection. I've seen literally every rule 34 post there is of her online. My dreams are nothing but constant fucking sex with Isabel. I'm sick of waking up every morning with six nuts in my boxers and knowing they should have been busted inside Isabel's tight dog pussy. I want her to have my mutant human dog babies. Fuck, my fucking mother caught me with the neighbor's dog. I dressed her in my sister's skirt and went to fucking town. She hasn't said a word to me in ten hours, and I'm worried she's going to take away my three decisive seconds. I might not ever get to see Isabel again. <laughs> that is scary. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> Isn't that incredible? <laughs> Why would Reggie say that, Tara? I don't know. Why would Reggie talk that way about a cartoon dog? Oh. 
and ghosts. Stuck his neighbor's dog in his sister's skirt. <laughs> Oh my fucking god, I wanna fuck Isabel so fucking bad. <laughs> that is incredible. I was laughing so hard at that thread. Holy fuck. Technology has officially gone too far, Tara. I'll I'll just say it. AI stuff like this. Okay. We have six bottles. Shit, now four. We missed four bottles somewhere. Somewhere along the lines. Tara is falling asleep. She is feeling very sleepy. I like the music in this section. It's very, like, ambient. So we need six bottles. Oh my god, what's this? What the? Cheddar! Cheddar's drinking fucking toilet water. Animals drinking toilet water is so funny. Schlop, schlop, schlop. Oh my god, I hate these fucking things. Stay the hell away from me. I 
fucking tree just dabbed on me. What the fuck? Oh my, where the fuck did you come from, you fucking gooey goo? Here, has, has Ali ever drank out of the toilet? Game over. We gotta set up a stream bot for this channel. I did not see that last time. She got no one to turn around.
That's stupid. these other bottles. Oh my god, there they were. That's it. Don't be game over, please don't be game over. Thank you. <laughs> we love terror, we do. the 
blueprints to this Ruby's production facility. I'll pipe this information into your binocucom. Use it to find breakables and clues nearby. Nice. And with that, I think we're done for the night. Thank you for joining, and we'll see you next time. Au revoir.